it will for once be fine if anybody understands justice and equality without discussing this for thousands, hundred to thousands decennias of time. To obtain the obvious. A wolf and go a vegan. Peace begins on the dinner table. By what you eat on a daily basis. You don't get brave all the time. Like people always like to me to tell. Anybody like to tell me they are so nice. They're so friendly. They're so good people. Because they live in a God. Because they believe in a Bible. Because they're pray to the black stay black stone in mega because they worship the holy wall in Israel because they're uh, worshiping some some Hindu temple or they're going to the murder festival where they kill billions of innocent animals only for the sick pleasure of some evil diva diva like Mara, the Hindu deva of murder, corruption, and other evil, uh, more other evils. Come on, people! We have extremely amount of delicious fruits, delicious vegetables, greens, lettuce, legumes, anything. You can ever imagine. And we can make it real. We can make all the products you like to make from plants. And some of the our vegans suck, I know it. But there are many that you like as well. Just like you don't like any animal products at all. Some of you like not. Don't uh, fuck with me. There are disgusting Chinese shitholes. Uh, of um, the restaurants, there are disgusting pizza joints and hamburger joints. So don't come out with the shit you want to tell me that there are that you have to eat some um, vegan stuff you don't like. Try something different. There are many things you can eat. You can also put your own sauces a little bit to it if you're not completely like the taste of some product. Be a little bit creative, people. How want you to feel if you are the victim? If your whole system and your whole society collapse and that you all live on the streets and that your government use you like slaves? People. Awaken, awaken, awaken. It is 2017. Stop in such shuttles. Go vegan. It is not hard. The only thing that seems hard is if it does because People are comfort to do nothing. People are comfort to be little obedient servants that do what their puppet masters, their politicians, their governments, their boss wants blindly without asking questions. Not people are told to not challenge authority. And I say, challenge authority. Great, a good idea. Because if their people are not become challenged, then we will be one day proved that we have nothing learned from the past. People are not gods. People are not angels. People are not perfect. Just the way they are. But at least when you become vegan, you try. You try to cause the least amount of harm possible on the planet. 
you try to live in harmony with the three laws of equality. At least, and I repeat, at least, you try to limit the amount of suffering you cost to this planet. Several times a week, several times a day, several times. This is your chance to actually do something instead of playing lip service to all the problems of the world and saying, Oh, I want to save people in Africa. I want to stop world hunger. I want that America stop bombing. Uh, Iraq nations and other Muslim countries. I wish uh, people want to stop uh, believing in Jesus in uh, the Bible and creating war about the Bible or the Quran or some other Abrahamic religion. This is your chance to st do actually against all the problems on this planet. I say you. At least 99% of all the problems all on this planet, I am convinced, are in one or another way linked to animal husbandry or slavery. You can call me on that, if you want. I'd like to prove that to you. So, awaken people. Might be possible. Make it possible. Make me proud. Convince as much people as you imagine can. Talk to your family members. I know some of them can extreme be extremely dickheads. Meat eat our colonists can be extremely dickheads sometimes, thinking that are superior because. Uh, traditions, because um, uh, society, because uh, uh, top of the food chain, uh, because the religion, because uh, on the moment you stop making excuses for the things you do, you realize your excuses are extremely weak, extremely self-righteous and extremely insignificant and can be used to dis justify mostly anything from slavery uh, to rape to child molestation and a lot of other things if you say yeah, that's okay because uh, we are stronger than them then you can say oh we can also kill mental retarded people because uh, we are stronger than Let's read our people. People, we have also large. We also be smarter than mental retarded people. Uh, so, like the Undro said, I have a Q far behind mental retarded people. So therefore, it is okay to eat them. It's not you say that it's okay to eat animals because they are less intelligent than most people. So it is okay to eat them. Get me a bath. You know, who are also an hypocrite? Okay. People awaken, uh, awaken. Stop being such ridiculous, arrogant, self righteous people. I say this not to be angry, to be a um, dickhead or uh, one <sighs> apathetic nitwit. I say this because this is the truth. And we have no right to enslave other living beings only for our time, for our pleasure. Just like a rapist have not the right to molest women for pleasure. Just like one child molester have not the right to rape and kill children for pleasure. Just like all evil punks in this world have not the right to do the, to the victims. Rights are not rights when somebody else has no rights. Taking the 
rights of another living being away is a direct violation of this living being their rights. Do you think that chickens in the chi in the egg industry like to be a round top in one machine? In the rendering machine? Think you that they find it's fine? Have you a brain or have you in this uh, place here have you only water? I mean a bunch of water sex. People stop being ridiculous. Stop being self righteous, arrogant, delusional, hypocritical, and stop in the first one century already. Must a small group of enlightened folk always have to convince the masses why rape, commodification, slavery are wrong? People? It will be for one time fine if we are not have to discuss this for hundreds or even thousands decennias of time. It will be for once fine if anybody understands justice and logic and equality, equality once for all and once for any. Why must always that be the case? Why not can for once be the majority not foolish? self-righteous and arrogant, just like the kings and queens of the Middle Age. Your meat is the most inane meat on the planet. And that's the best form of protein, because it is similar like my meat. It's particular before I was dead. So, I have to eat someplace. I have to get my protein, you know. I can also eat plants. It is no fun! Then i running away. Because I'm a psychopath and I like to scare my food and make them, make them tasty. Um, because of the fear. Because I'm psychotic. Very fine that you give, uh, that you actually admit that you are psychotic, mate. But that you are psychotic don't mean that you have the right to other, eat other living beings. Even if you are stronger than them, it don't make it moral justifica justifiable. Because that means also that one, uh, some hundred kilograms a uh, meal have the right to uh, rape and molest one woman of 60 kilograms because she is uh, physical capable of doing that. But I say that is not something that is justifiable. I say that is immoral. Might don't make a right. This don't work in a civilized society. You, no. Only an uncivilized society say okay to that kind of immoral behavior. Or actually I like to call it an uncivilized cult.